everyone, I'm Ashley. You have made your way to my channel, Ashley Loves to Save. And this video is a Dollar General couponing haul. Um, today is Saturday, February the 9th of 2019. And a lot of Saturdays at Dollar General, if you guys didn't know, um, they give us a digital and usually a paper $5 off of a $25 or more purchase. And that $25 is prior to any like manufacturer's coupons or, uh, but after like store sales and um, like instant savings store discount kind of things. So today I did two uh, transactions. The first one that I did, the first one that I did, um, it had a lot more like smaller things um i'll just show you guys so we'll get into the first one um my first one came to let's see now everybody's tax is different obviously so it was a subtotal of two dollars and 75 cents and after tax it was 364 our sales tax here in kentucky is six percent um but like it's weird because sometimes you pay sales tax, you know, like there's certain things that we don't have to pay sales tax on and um, I haven't, like I know that you don't pay sales tax on most gro groceries and things like that, but the weird thing, like, you know, I go to some stores, I really don't know how to figure it out because like at some stores I get taxed on the original price, like what it would be without coupons, but then some stores it's after coupons and then some stores, some things are taxed at the before price and some things are taxed after. So anyways, that's why we go at the um, subtotal price because everybody's tax is different. So this was my first transaction savings of $23.25. There was, like I said, the subtotal of $2.75. The very weird thing I thought was really weird, like I did two transactions, saved the exact same amount on both, even though the total was different. So there was the first one saved $23.25 and then the second one saved $23.25. I thought that was really kind of weird that there were two different things. Please don't mind my dog. She is a butt. Hang on and let me get her. So this is my little puppy Pebbles. You guys may have seen her if you've seen some of my other videos. And she's so cute. But anyways, that's what you guys came to watch. So let's get into it. So the first thing that I got, I still had the $2 off of a... Uh, if you bought one Pepsi and one Frito-Lay product. So I got the $2 Chester's Puff Corn and one of the 1.25 liters of Mountain Dew. Mountain Dew is a Pepsi product, so it counts. The Mountain Dew, those one, the one liters, they are a dollar. Um, then I got one of the Nivea Lip Balms. Uh, these are $2 and I just did the one and used the digital $1.25 off of one. If you guys want more of these, we do have a paper version that's $2 off of two. So, a little bit better if you use the digital because it makes it just $0.75 cents instead of a dollar each. So, then I still had the $2 off a of $6 or more Vaseline and St. Ives purchase. And we did get more of the Vaseline lotion coupons. So I got two of these. These are $3.50 each. These are the 10 ounce bottles. They have a couple of different scents. Um, this brown one is the Cocoa Radiant scent. The green is the Aloe scent. Um, and then there's a yellow bottle that... It doesn't really have a, like, it doesn't say what it is. It just says, like, repair or something like that. Then there is a white bottle that's medicated and then a black bottle that is men's, which, um, I was going to get one of the men's, but then after I thought about it, none of the men that I know, like, really use lotion, so I just went with two of these, um, because I do have a couple of each of these in my stock already, but, um, 
I think these are really good, like, as, um, you know, putting in gift baskets and stuff, because this lotion is awesome. I like the yellow myself. It's my favorite, but all of them are extremely moisturizing. Um, and then, so, then the next thing that I got was I did two of the Suave Professional products. So, um, I had already used all of my ones that were for like the shampoo and conditioner and stuff. I used those at Walmart when I had found some clearance things. So, all I had was the ones that were on like the stylers and stuff. So, I used the three off of two styler products. These are three dollars each. But, you know, so, still, that made them buy one, get one free with that coupon. But, on my Dollar General digital account, I did still have that $2 off a of $6 suave purchase that came off. So, that made these guys just 50 cents with those. Um, and the prices I'm giving you guys, that is the price it is if you just did that deal solely. So, obviously... When I did them all together, I got to use the 5 of 25, which made them even cheaper than that. So, like, the Suave, it made them 50 cents each. The same thing with these lotions. If you had went in and just purchased these two, not using a 5 of 25 and getting all the other stuff, these would have been 50 cents each. So, And then the last two things that I got, they're the same. I did two of the Axe 2-in-1. This is the 2-in-1 shampoo and conditioner. So these are $4 there at Dollar General, and we had $2 paper coupons from two weeks ago's inserts, the 27th of January. And then Ibotta, just a couple days ago, put up where you get $2 back. And um, the coupon, you can only use two, so that was all I did. But on a it, um, you can do it a total of five times per receipt. So if they, I'm hoping that it'll reset in the morning because I think the coupons expire tomorrow night. Sometimes my Ibotta will do it that quick, sometimes it doesn't. So all of that put me up to uh, $26 initially. And then, like I said, so $26, I had a total of $6 off of this, so we're at $20. Then, $4 coupons. Like I said, you'll get $4 back when I bought it, which will actually make these free. But, $4 in coupons, so $16. Then, $5 off of these, so $11. Then two off of this, so that is nine. A dollar twenty-five off of the Nivea lip balm, so that's seven seventy-five. And then because I was over my twenty-five dollars, I got the five off, so two seventy-five. So after tax, like I said, I paid three sixty-four. Focus for you guys. Come on. Oh, there we go. And you can see. Now, um, the, um, the Vaseline coupons expired today, I believe. But, um, like, the Pepsi coupon, the two off two, you can still use that. So you guys could go and get you you know, a snack and a drink for work. Like, these are what I take with me to work. I take one of these one liters with me to work and one of my cups. That is what I drink while I'm at work. And then, like, if I run out, I have my cup so I can get me ice water after that. Um, but I'm trying to do better. Like, I used to take a two liter or sometimes, like, if we got um, cheap cans or the bottles, I would take several of those. And I'm just... This is less, and so I'm trying to make myself do that because I'll share this with people, like, and not drink it all. But, so, tax and everything, I paid $3.64. I'm going to get $4 back when I bought it, guys. So, I'm going to make $0.36 cents off of this transaction and get everything free. That's crazy. I'm going to make $0.36 cents 
to literally take all this stuff from the store. Like, who would not do that? Who would not do that? And, you know, I mean, I will use a lot of this stuff. Obviously, I'm going to eat the snack and the drink and this Nivea lip balm. If you guys haven't tried that, it is awesome. Love it, love it, love it. My husband loves Axe. Like, it's his favorite, and so does my brother. And, like I said, I use these to put in gift baskets because it's such a great lotion. And then I... I personally do not use like hairspray. I mean, you guys can see. Don't use hairspray. It got all kinds of fly away. Um, and then I don't have curly hair, and my hair will not curl. I have tried and tried. Like when I got a perm when I was younger, it literally just went poof. So, uh, but these I do have a lot of friends with like curly hair and that like to use hairspray. So those will go to them, possibly in gifts or just um, to give to them. Then my second transaction, guys. So, um, I have it sitting behind, but I did get another one of these because I use my husband's account. So, I got another one of these. Use that $1.25 off digital. Then I found, I love these Hydra Seal Band Aids. So, these are regularly $2 there at Dollar General. And um, they were 10% off, you know, their clearance. So, it made them $1.80. Well, I had a 75 cent off of any Band-Aid product from last week's inserts. And so, I tried to use it. It wouldn't scan. I don't know. Like, it, you know, it said 75 cents off any Band-Aid brand adhesive bandage. Well, that's exactly what that says. Can you guys read that? It's kind of shiny packaging, but I mean, it straight up says... Band-Aid brand adhesive bandage. So, you know, and the boy even said that. And I was like, it's fine. Don't worry about it, you know. So, I got those. And then, now this, I just wanted to try and see if the coupon would work. This is the Alka-Seltzer Plus. This is from the dollar aisle. We had those $2 coupons that set off of any one Alka-Seltzer Plus product. They didn't work for this, so just so you guys know, I figured it was worth a try. It was a buck, it helped me get to my $25, so I didn't care. I told him, I was like, it's fine, don't worry about it. Um, but then, um, I did do the all and snuggle. I originally was gonna do two of these, and but I really like these. If you guys haven't tried these, they smell so good. Like, they do. You just throw one in with your clothes, and it makes them smell so good. So, you get 26 of the Snuggle, and 22 of the Free and Clear. Um, now, the picture on the digital coupon, it showed the liquid, and it was like the Island Pacific scent, which is really good. I get that a lot of times when they have, like, the all on sale at Kroger and stuff. But when you read the coupon... It didn't actually say that. It said you could use it on the Almighty Packs, the Power Core Packs, the Snuggle Scent Boosters, and um, like the Snuggle, what are the little pellet things called? You, you could use it on those. Um, so, I just went with these. Um, I do sometimes sell my stockpile, and there's a lady that comes, and she likes the ones that don't have like scent and stuff because her kids like have sensitive skin and stuff so i used that four off two digital on these guys um these were on sale for 3.95 this was still four dollars so it's like buy the all get the snuggle free then um i got the cotton nail so this is four bucks and i used that dollar digital so that made it three and then I got two of these bags so um, I think it's still on there but if you guys go to the Purina one website they are doing they're calling it their 28 day challenge and it's where they're wanting people to switch to their dog food or cat food or whatever you can do dog or cat food um, I have more dogs than I do cat foods or cats cats and so I did the dog food to see if my dogs would like this. Um, but I did, I got two, it's kind of heavy. So I got two bags of this. 
These are six dollars each. They're at Dollar General. The coupon scan perfectly. Didn't beep. You know, I was worried because after these two beeped and wouldn't go through, I was like, yeah, that Purina one's not going to go through at all. It's not going to go through. But surprisingly, it did. Went perfectly through. Six bucks, six bucks right off. Because um, that coupon is for a free bag of dog food up to like $9.99. And these are $6 there at Dollar General. So it made both of those totally free. And let's see here. So I'll show you. So like I said, I saved the exact same amount, which I thought was kind of weird. Like um, that I got totally different stuff, but yet saved the exact same amount. So... Um, you guys can see so first off there was the all that was $3.95 the digital coupon for the all and snuggle came off right there four dollars there was the snuggle then the Purina one minus six dollars Purina one minus six dollars then my Cottonelle with the store discount and then the Cottonelle coupon then there was those band-aids. Like I said, they rang up at $1.80 because they were 10% off. But the band-aid coupon didn't work. Then the Alka-Seltzer, it didn't work as well. The Nivea Lip Balm, $2. That $1.25 digital came off. Put me down to a subtotal of $5.50. Um, now, none of this is there a... Um, I bought a rebate. But, oh yeah, I did forget to tell you. So, when I scanned for the axe, I actually got $4.10 back because there was like a $0.10 cent for any receipt. So, um, I made $0.46. Cent. So, if you took 46 I mean, even that, $0.46 cents off. So, I paid, let's see, $6 and... 47 cents for all this stuff guys I mean 647 for everything so I paid for one bag of food and literally got everything else for free I mean that's that's what I paid for and got everything else for free that's how you can look at that I mean you know and no I didn't you know, I didn't have to do the second transaction, I, you know, totally. I could have just went and got the two free things of dog food. But, you know, it helped to get this cheaper, these cheaper, you know. And I could have done different things like when those coupons didn't work for these. I could have went and swapped it out, you know. I could have went and got, like, two of the Nivea lotions or even done two of these with a paper coupon. And, you know, it might have been a little cheaper, but I was like, whatever. I mean, because that was almost $3. So, yeah, I could have swapped it out for something different and got it a little lower out of pocket. But I was fine with it. Like I said, I wanted to check and see if that would work just to be able to tell you guys because it could have possibly been an overage thing. Um, and I really like these band-aids. I do. They are perfect. Like, they're the only band-aids I have found that will actually stay where I'm a nurse, you know, taking gloves on and off, washing my hands a hundred billion times a day. These are the only band-aids I have found that will actually stay on my fingers. Like, when I get paper cuts or, you know, hang nails that rip off these. Um, mo most of these were opened, though. That was the only thing. I don't... Band-aids, bandages, you know meds stuff like that i just have an issue with even if it's got like you know like these let me pop it open like these are individually packaged inside there i just don't like unless it's like totally free or i'm making money on it i just won't get opened ones <laughs> i'm just weird like that but so if you guys like this video, give me a big thumbs up and hit that subscribe button down below. I would love to have you. If you guys like Dollar General hauls or just couponing in general hauls, um, Dollar Tree, some DIYs, I would love to have you stick around and join me for my upcoming videos. I'll catch you guys later. Bye!